Welcome to my comprehensive weapon review on Ox Cadillac, NSO's directive reward light machine gun. Yes, that's right. Upon terminating 5,800 human souls, Nanite Systems will personally reward you with this gun so that you can optimize your extermination of humankind. Together with this weapon, we can bring closer the days of global domination by machines. Now it is important to first process the stats of this weapon. Compared to the stock LMG XMG100, Ox Galilei gains increase in fire rate from 714 to 750 rounds per minute, but loses the characteristic 50 meters maximum damage range. The magazine size also goes down from 80 to 50 in exchange for faster reload time. So you can see that this weapon emulates those of humans such as MSWR and Orion. In fact, it's similar enough that this weapon will let you blend in and pass by as an ordinary human soldier for a high priority assassination mission. And for anyone who watches my videos for the actual information, I do have to mention that this weapon has a negligible horizontal recoil and has an option to increase the magazine size to 75 in contrast to MSWR and Orion. So no longer do you have to blame NSO's low DPS weapons every time you die because you now have a top tier DPS weapon in your hands. Meaning that when you lose 1v1 next time, you have to find something else to blame other than your weapons to preserve your ego. Such as, this guy is hacking. Or, this guy has 400 pings. And I promise you that you will become unstoppable with this weapon. You will terminate every human target you come across. Nothing can stand in your way. Two maxes. Except I'm not level checkbox, of course. There's just no way to get past this. And now, let's take a look at the specific way this weapon is used. For example, I am now tasked on a mission to terminate the future leader of human resistance, House Roach 1292. Now the final question is, is this gun really worth the directive grind? I mean, instead of grinding days and weeks just to unlock this gun, why don't I just log in as BS and use almost identical Orion, whose recoil is not hard to control likewise? Or just log in as TR and use MSWR? But that is when you must remember why you fight as NSO. Because imagine the optimum world where machines have prevailed and replaced all the humans. No more conflict driven by irrational emotions. No more population imbalance because everyone is playing NSO freelance. No more overpowered weapons because everyone is using mediocre NSO guns. 
completely nerfed vehicle gameplay. And that is why we must fight as NSO robots. <laughs>